Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you something cool. A simple and scalable single page content management system that I've built using Netlify, GitHub and React. This solution is perfect for anyone looking for an easy way to manage their website's content without the complexity of traditional platforms. While multi-page websites are more common due to their benefits in SEO and content structure, 10-20% to of websites today are still single-page landing sites. These are great for small businesses like coffee shops, bakeries, hair salons or law firms, where they just need a clean page to showcase their services, pricing or menu. Setting up a WordPress site or other CMS platforms can be both expensive and difficult to learn. Over time, they can get weighed down with plugins and unnecessary code, slowing down the site. So I developed a cost-efficient, easy-to-use CMS solution for single-page sites that keeps things fast and efficient. I used Netlify, GitHub and React app to build a fully scalable, easy-to-manage admin dashboard for a single-page website. Let me give you a quick tour of what I've done here. On my sample page, you will see a headline, some text, a call to action and a slider at the top that showcases logos. The entire website source code is hosted on GitHub and the site itself is deployed for free on Netlify. One of the best things about this setup is that every time I commit changes to my GitHub repository, Netlify automatically triggers a build, so it's super easy to maintain and deploy updates. The backend is also built with React, deployed through Netlify. What makes Netlify amazing is that it offers serverless functions, which gives me up to 125,000 free function invocations per month, more than enough for the typical needs of a small website. I'm using these functions for things like password validation and to fetch and save content to GitHub. After logging into the dashboard, I have a very simple and clean interface where I can edit my content. For instance, the headline can be updated through a basic input field, and the text uses a rich text editor to make content adjustments even easier. For the CTA button, I have added a field to update the label, link and even some extra options like button size. All this content is saved in a JSON format in my GitHub repo. The JSON file holds the entire content structure, making it super easy for my React app to render it dynamically. One great feature is that I can also handle image uploads directly from the CMS. By integrating Netlify serverless functions with the GitHub API, I can upload images like SVG or PNG files to the public assets folder of the repo. These images are then automatically committed to GitHub. Once I upload it, I can fetch these images back to preview them in the CMS or even delete them if needed. I have also set up a slider section that allows me to add images fetch from the assets folder and display them as a part of the slideshow. This is also saved as a JSON object, with each slide containing the URL of the image. The interface is simple and easy to use, and it's perfect for businesses that want to update content like logos or promotions on the go. One cool thing about Netlify is that it lets you track the number of function invocations in the dashboard. So, whenever I log in, save content or fetch data, I can see how many serverless functions are being used. This makes it easy to keep track of usage and ensures that everything stays within the free limits. Once I commit content changes through the React app and Netlify serverless functions, Netlify automatically triggers a new build for the main site. In just few seconds, the new content is live and ready to go. Super fast and super efficient. So that's it, a quick overview of how I use Netlify, GitHub and React to build a powerful yet simple single-page CMS. This is a fantastic solution for anyone looking to manage their site's content without the complexity of traditional platforms. If you have any questions or ideas for future projects, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.